one issue or one perspective that is sort of missing from the public discourse uh, is the dalit perspective about these farm bills um so uh, i actually wanted to understand from you um, how, what does it mean for dalits uh, when you look at you know the political economy of uh, these issues uh, how, how how what is the dalit perspective on these uh, issues well i would say you know uh, it's far better for the dalits to work in the factories of ambani and adani than to work on the fields of kisans i mean there is no it's just a no brainer because uh, if you go to the countryside the as i told you the farmers are not the majority population of the country they're not even the majority population of the villages so uh, non kisans from the majority population of the villages uh, and a large number of them are landless laborers who are mostly from the dalit caste so they come from all the caste you know there will be even some forward caste people who are also landless laborers but mostly the landless laborers are the dalits because they hardly own uh, any land and of course there are lots of regional variation as well so we cannot generalize for the whole country but this is a pattern we we'll see uh, and these farmers and these landless laborers have uh, are you know exploited like anything i mean there is economic exploitation there is social oppression and there is political marginalization the condition is not really good i mean it's a very bad condition of the dalits in the countryside you look at punjab uh, 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 dalits are 30 to 32% population of the punjab which is the highest in the country i mean up has only around 20% and they form a government in up you have 32% population they are nowhere to be seen in the political power uh, the reason is that in an uh, agrarian state like punjab where you know the politics revolves around the agriculture and the agriculture sector is very powerful the dalits hardly own 2 to 3% of the agricultural land that is the extent of you know uh, uh, exclusion let's say from the mainstream so uh, they really don't have much stake in this system right continuation system and also when you are giving higher msp to the uh, the kisans that might benefit some of the major bigger kisans but that will cause higher inflation and that is going to hurt these landless laborers because they have to go and buy the food grains if msp artificially high price is causing higher inflation the majority of the rural population also stands to lose right so for for just for benefiting certain kisans in the villages you are harming the majority of the urban uh, the rural population not saying that the urban population also is getting harmed so uh, uh, and that is why you know, dalits do not really have much stake uh, they will rather work in the factories they will rather you know be the slave of the ambani than the slave of the kisans i mean not that being slave is a good thing but it's a better off situation because ambani is not the ambani does not go and kick the dalits ambani does not go and beat the dalits for drinking water from the well ambani never stop the barats of a dalit that you know you can't ride on the horse or you can't do this thing ambani is not abusing dalits on the basis of caste ambani is not practicing untouchability and exclusion right and like kisan so i think you know it's it's just not even a brainer i think for dalits is better to move away from the agriculture sector is better for them to leave the villages and move to the cities and the industrial sectors right uh, thank you so much uh, for sharing that perspective abhinav ji i think it's much needed uh, and i see it's completely missing uh, in the public discourse namaste we hope you enjoyed this chitti media content please remember to subscribe to us and switch on the notifications for this channel for our other social media links more content and to support our work please visit cittti.net dhanyawad namaskar